Right, Kira team. Um, look, we pick up where we left off, and um, there's a couple of things I want to do before we start fulfilling the quest part. Um, I guess the first thing is we're looking for box number seven in the credit union, right? Something is happening in box number seven. Uh, right. Stuff. Look around. Thank goodness. Oh yeah, I'm 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 in need of food and drink. Don't know how that happened. Um, let's have a look at that food. What have we got? Food situation. Energy five hundred, three hundred, four ninety five, six. Wonder why that's blue. It's gonna make me cold. Uh, does it have water as well? Let's see what happens. Why is that blue? Uh, I got some water. Just good. So it's sort of 250, 250. Alright, hydrated. Not starving. Um... Yeah, papers, papers. If I were a box, where would I be? Probably not on the toilet. This stuff will come in handy. Now, they seem to be decent. Let's, um, let's have a look. Uh, it's automatically swapped up to a decent pair, has it? Fine, to yourself. I could use this. Could I? Can I? Now, here's a question. Can I put something in a container and get it back out again? So let's um, put that in there. Right, and walk away. And come back. Right, it's still there, so I can make stashes. So that's good to know. Um, I want to know if I can make a stash in um, uh, well I say that but I can't actually get to the container how do I get to the container that's the container but I can't I can't get it out so I, I put it in oh no there we are I can't get it out right okay 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 uh, what's that hiding there in a coffee here? Who knows? Um, yeah, okay. And a mug. A cup of coffee. Good to have a cup. <clears throat> so. Tickety boot. Uh, bank Locked. vault. Can't need get a, in here yet. Need a code. Need a code. Is that one of these things? I gotta find the codes. Can't get in here yet. So, what I'm looking for is some kind of note, possibly, that somebody left behind. Not, not that. So, it's obviously not there. A few moments later. Aha! 
will unlock one of the houses in Milton. Must be the key to the bank manager's house. Right, so presumably he has the codes. Right, so... Um, yeah, so what I was saying, and the reason I'm asking the question is, um, if we go back to the Grey Mother's house, um, can I stash some of the stuff at her house? I am carrying a lot of stuff. And I just, I don't really feel like I need to carry it around right now. I'm not, I'm not leaving Milton, right, for a little bit. Um, let's, let's say this thing. If I were to put that wood in, which carries 40 kgs, boom, right, step away from the cabinet. And I then come back. And I open the cabinet, and I have that wood there that I can take out. Now, how long does that stay there? Let's uh, let's 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 conduct a little experiment. Let's put something in there that we're not super bothered about. Right, so books we can get easy. Let's put those in. Fire, fire, fire lighting stuff. Coal, uh, paper we can get easy. That we can get easy. That we can get easy. We got nine of those. Okay, we're not going to be lighting a fire anytime soon. Matches. Uh, they don't weigh much. Hang on to those. Um, first aid. Let's just hang on to that in case something goes wrong. Um, right. There's a whole bunch of things that uh, maybe might be important to us. Um, you know, I probably don't need that. What's that? A sewing kit. I might need that. Road flares. Probably not super urgent. I think that's important. <clears throat> if we lose that, it might be a problem. Crafting side of things. Uh, probably not so worried about uh, that or fresh rabbit pelt. Right, so um, there's 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 stuff in there that we're keeping in there that we just want to check, right? If if I leave <laughs> and it's all gone, yeah, you're tired. If I leave and it's all gone when I come back after trying to explore this bank manager's house, uh, then we know that we can't really save gear in her house. Right, so uh, bank manager's house. I don't think it's along here. Um, where is our map? So that's the tunnel, which is fine. Uh, but we're we're just we're just nosing around. Uh, we might take a run up to the church. I am th I'm perpetually one of those people that doesn't follow the story, which is, you know, I'm I'm sorry about that. Um, if you came here looking for someone who's going to slavishly walk through the playthrough, and Hello. And find you all the answers. Um, it's probably not me. I'm gonna go off the beaten track, probably. Bit worried about that wolf. Aha! There we go. You might find it. Right, so. We're looking for clues. Is that just a book? 
bank vault code. This is the code. <laughs> Read it. What does it say? 193008. Let's take that. Code of the bank vault. That's the vault. <clears throat> okay, let's go here. 19. Right, uh, what does that... we got to go the other way. Ah, oh. I got it. So go this way. No, it doesn't like it. I gotta go back out again. Let's try this again. So this way to 19. This way to 30. And the other way to 8. Got it. My word. Took a bit of thinking. Ah, <sighs> for the heart of thinking, huh? Not interested. More stuff, more books, things, cardboard boxes, what's in the container? Nothing. Nothing. And we have vault number seven. This will come in handy. Cash. Useful as tender. Oh. Flare shells. And everything else is shut. Oh, that one's locked. Locked. What have we here? Right, okay. Well, <coughs> we've pretty much done that. So, we've done a couple of things which may or may not have triggered Grey Mother's cabinet. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back and we're going to check the cabinet. Then what we might do is... It's, it's, it's daytime. Don't really want to go to sleep, but I am looking pretty tired. Because, I mean, if if this game is sort of inviting you to be a bit of a loot goblin, right? Where you just gotta get stuff. Um, so, I mean, I guess... Still there. Anyway, uh, something else we had to do was use the repair kit. Now, um... How do we do that, do you think? Right, we have a repair kit. So I think what, essentially, we need to go back. We need to go back and have a look at what we're wearing. Good old trusty parka. Does it need a repair? 66% actions. Repair. Yes, let's repair it. Right, it's back up to 99. Okay, what else are we wearing on the outside? Uh, what's that? Winter forecast. A note with details on weather. Heavy snow. She won't like it one bit. We'll need to check on her. Someone has to. Okay. Oh, now you want me to add more. Uh, interesting. 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 So... Hmm. Looks like I'm going to be looking after you for a while, ma'am. Um, yeah, thank you. 
how did I pass time, right? Go up to the bed, pass time. I don't know how I got the timing wrong, but um, what we might do is four hours. There we go. Daylight. Playing cards. Right. I'd better find some water. Uh, I got some. Have some of that stuff. It's good for you. Your teeth will rot, but, you know. You'll be fine. Right, so, what I was going to do, before we were so rudely interrupted, was, um, now, now that I can use this little stash store, and, um, it's got bags and bags of room for, for stuff, um, I've got things that I think I might need in case of something going strangely weird. Um, what I want to do is, uh, go out and grab some stuff. Um, predominantly cloth for repairs. Obviously now she needs more wood and food. Um, so we're going to go on another scavenger hunt. Um, which is probably not going to be very, very exciting. Um, because I'm going to have to go around and loot lots of places. So it's probably going to be a time lapse. So I shall see you all very, very soon.
I'm um, just on the trail of a stash up in this cave that we passed, uh, taken from a clue from a note in one of the towns and in, in one of the um, houses in Milton. It's getting dark out here. Time to look for shelter. Always use more food. Honestly, thought there would be more than that. <clears throat> I just have to um, get these um, this rose hip tea made to get one of my achievements. if I'm getting the wrong end of the stick? What if it's the fire? You cook something. I've got a can. Yes. Yes. Ah, there we go. See? 12 minutes until ready. Well, that took an age to work out amongst many confusions. Um... But yeah, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. So we can make a prepared rose hip tea by, by you click on the fire, not the item, which was um, which was what I was doing wrong. Whew. Anyway, sorted that out. Blimey, O'Reilly. Took a while. Monkey around in these things at the night time while we're here. We've got a safe place to stay. And... Um, yeah, and it gives us a chance to do this kind of mucking about, and we use the daytime to run around and explore, huh? <laughs> uh, effective, natural. I'm just going to carry it around. A few moments later. Right, what I want to do is, um... Uh, I, want, I want to run over the bridge. I want to check out what these are over here. And um, and I think possibly we'll want to take it, see if we can get a nosy up to St. Christopher's Church <clears throat> before we go on and do this, which is the next part of the story. So I'm going to run around and do that and um, see if anything strange, startling, or fascinating happens. I'll see you in a minute. <clears throat> okay, so there's um, I'm out here at Paradise Meadows Farms. And uh, I need a key to get into Paradise Meadows Farms, which is that these buildings down here on the edge of the map, I believe. There's a wolf in there with a bit of a deer. So maybe what I'll do is I will save my game. Because, <laughs> you know, not all daft. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and scare this... Uh, scare this wolf off with this flare. Oh, that's a shit. It's a dead person. But no key. Sure did. Got a flare. What is this? A snare. Field dressing. A workbench. Another hatchet. It looks like there's some very, uh, very good stuff out here. So, a workbench is just that for making things, right? I, d I have a blueprint for a snare. 
I need cured gut, reclaimed wood, a workbench in 30 minutes. I see. Okay. So that's what that's for. Been through those. That's a cardboard box. That's a cardboard box. That's things for the fire to keep me warm. And I can't climb that. And I didn't find the keys. I just found a dead person. Right, okay. Um, yeah, so, sorry. I, uh... I thought I had you on, but I didn't have you on. Um, I, I ran across a deer that uh, Wolf had pulled down. And uh, I broke out that flare that I picked up on the workbench. And I lit it. And uh, the wolf wasn't none too impressed until I threw it at it. And then the wolf ran off. And I... Um, and I harvested the deer, um, and uh, and I got myself a whole stack of deer meat, um, and I just want to get back to the grey mothers, and um, and I'll show you what that looks like, um, and then we'll put it on to cook, um, uh, in part because you know we still have to um, fulfill this more food for the grey mother thing. Which, I don't know, I, uh, is there a bonus at the end of this? I don't know. Is it a trophy? Oh, I'm not sure. Um, are we supposed to be doing it? I, yeah, well, possibly. Maybe there's <clears throat> some part of the story that becomes important later that she doesn't die. <laughs> I don't know. <clears throat> um, but anyway, um, we're going to go and do that right now. But now we know Paradise Meadows, and there's a, a workbench down there, and um, and what we need to do is we need to get the, uh, there we go, we got one, two, how many can I cook here? That's it, we've only got two cooking slots, is that one, 55 minutes, and 54 minutes, core blimey roly governor. Um, yeah, so where were we? Where did I get? What's this? Oh, my shard is broken. Ruined beyond repair. Um, food wise. Uh, yeah, look at this. I mean, rafts and rafts of the stuff. So with any luck, um, we should be able to cook some of this uh, venison up. I mean, it looks good. 900 raw. I don't know what it's like cooked, and what we might do is, we might save some of the good stuff, um, if venison is indeed the good stuff, and she can have all the canned stuff. Yes, you. I'm looking at you. You can have all the canned stuff. We'll have all the good stuff. You can have the moldy granola bars. Look at your gun. You still haven't sorted your gun out. You've got a gun rack above the fire. Ugh can't help some people right so uh so yeah this is going to take a while so i'm going to have to cook up all this venison which is going to take me like a day um to cook and um and then what i'll do is i'll i'll transfer all of the food out of there into her fridge so that we only have good stuff and she can have all the canned stuff and um and we'll take it from there and um well now that i've been we're gonna have um take a run up to St. Christopher's Church, and then we're going to um, take a run down to um, the tunnel, because that's the next part of the story. And then we'll have, to my satisfaction, probably scouted out Milton so far, uh, scavenged as much as we need to scavenge, found our way around, and then we can move on with the story. That's about that. See you in a minute. <clears throat> Kia ora again. Well, we're coming up on the church, and it's... Um, it's fairly nasty weather outside. Temperatures dropping. Um, but yeah, but here we are. Let's let's see what's in the church. Let's get inside. At least we can get inside. <clears throat> Saint Christopher's Church. Okay.
burning the good book might be sacrilege. The hat. Pyramidons. Useless when wet. Okay. Right, anything else? No. Somebody, um, somebody making a fire? This will come in handy. Books and things for fire lighting and bedroll. <coughs> so, a secondary place to hang out. And, um, what's this? The pastor's note. Let's have a read of this. Dear parishioners, it is with a heavy heart that I inform you of the Archdiocese's decision to withdraw me from St. Christopher's Parish due to lack of activity. Though there have never been more than a few of you in recent years, your dedication to the church and support of my efforts here will not be forgotten. Henceforth, services will be available via Skype only. Zooms not allowed. Continued Latin lessons also. Please accept my apologies. God bless. Father Francis McGill. Oh well. There you go. Bed. Canola bar. I wonder if this is any good to eat. Who knows? Water, which is good, because I need water. A flare, which is good. Some kindling that I can probably leave here. I can't do anything with those. Another book. <clears throat> well, uh, yeah, disappointing to say the least. Um, I was hoping for more, uh, and more is not here. So, uh, let us uh, head back, and we will head back via Grey Mother's, and um, I just want to talk to you about a couple of things about Grey Mother's house, and um, and then we'll head down to that tunnel, shall we? Because I'm pretty sure we're sort of done as much as I really want to do out here for now. I don't know what's that way off into the wilderness and wilds, perhaps. But there you go. Hey, hot tip. If you're looking for wood, there's a whole bunch of pallets over the bridge outside town. Right, so, um, while I seek shelter and warmth from that ridiculous storm outside, let's talk about Grey Mother for a while. So, uh, this is Grey Mother's fridge, and this is where you put the food that you gave to Grey Mother. Now, I have found out that this fridge can be a bit sketchy. So, so if you put food in this fridge, you're not getting it back out again. Except sometimes. Like, he'll take dog food. So... And sometimes energy bars. So, I, I, I don't know. It seems a bit... I can't get any of that out. Or that. So, I don't... Uh, maybe it's bugged, and sometimes you can get the food out, and sometimes you can't, or something. Um, I, I don't know. I gave her a couple of... Venisons, which now I can get out. I, I, I didn't... I wasn't able to get out, and now I can get out. So, I don't know what the story about with that is, about that sketchy fridge. Um, one of the things is... Oh, sorry. So, while you're ful fulfilling uh, this task about her extra supplies, um, if you take the food out, you... Um, you obviously you, you drop your number drops against that uh, against that value so I had given her um, all of these things like the cattail the condensed milk the dog food the energy bars the granola bar she's not having that the salty crackers she's not having my coffee I had given her two venisons uh, because and um, and that's it. And that took her up to I want to say about seventeen thousand and something. Yeah, seventeen thousand seven hundred and seventeen. So um, 
Yeah, there you go. I need like another 3,000. But, uh, look, we'll keep it there for now. And, um, and we'll leave it at that. So, what I want to do is I want to get some stuff for this journey. So, I don't think we're going to be needing to light any fires. Uh, I think we got enough pills, maybe. I might bring that. Uh, I don't think we're going to need any special clothes, so I can probably get rid of the ones that I'm not wearing. Thank you very much. I'm wearing I'm wearing a woolier cap. Okay. Uh, I, I can't imagine I'm going to need my herbal teas or my coffee. Um, I realize that I probably want that because it's very, very good. Um, uh, that's all good. I probably not gonna want the snare. I might save a player too. Everything else is probably fine. Cloth is fine. Probably not gonna want my rose hips. <sighs> right. <clears throat> so I think I'm ready to go. Um, and, um, I'm going to head down to the tunnel, and, um, I'll see you there. See you in a minute. Right, well, I do believe that's the tunnel there. <clears throat> um, I've just come from the gas station. Methuselah is missing. Um, not there. He's taken his grill. It's gone, too. Um, so, don't know what the story about that is, but, um, this here be the tunnel, I guess. So let's go see what the story is with the tunnel. What happened here? Pills? Felons. Right, so are these the guys that ran through town? 15 inmates, no known medical conditions. Crow feathers. Rocks. I guess you can go inside the bus, can you? Hmm. I see. Was that it? I <laughs> come all this way. For a scrolled note saying perseverance and to tell me that uh, a prison bus carrying 15 inmates 14 inmates um, crashed and um, and that's what all the ruckus was about and that perhaps Methuselah? What's his story? Is he an inmate? All that nonsense? Is he just some, uh, some crooked old inmate? I guess we'll, um, we'll, we'll hot foot it back to the Grey Mother and we'll find out what she has to say, shall we? So here we are, I've, I've run across this wolf. So I've got my flare out. There's two of them. He's gonna, uh... So, throw the flare at him. Leg it. You two can leg it. I'm gonna, um... Take this. While that flare still goes. Which is now gone. 
And then I'm gonna leg it out of here. There you go. That's how you, um... That's how you steal stuff from a wolf. Daring, I know. Anyway. It'll, um, give me something else to cook. And, um... See what grandmother has to say, shall we? Alright, old lady, spill it. Did you find it? It was there, like you said. And your friend? No sign of her. The tunnel's blocked. Looks like maybe an avalanche. But I think she got through before that happened. If the tunnel is blocked, that's the end for Grandmother. So the tunnel is the only way through the mountains? No. Not the only way through, but my only way through. She was there at the tunnel, at the bus. I'm sure of it. You think she passed through the tunnel? I'm not sure, but she was there. She left me a sign, a word, perseverance. A word from the old days, why would she write that? She's telling me she won't give up. Or maybe reminding you not to. Why write such a long name though? It has to mean something more. Why? Because you mean so much to her? Because she wrote it in blood. I seem to recall a town somewhere up north, far, what was it called? That's it. Perseverance Mills. Old logging and mill town used to be an important place. Now it's mostly dead, like Milton. Maybe she's pointing you there. Perseverance Mills. How do I get there? By car. Before the quakes, when the roads were clear. Looks like I'm on foot. That will be a long road. I'm starting to get pretty worried about my friend. There's only one thing left to be done. You need to put her to rest. Put her to... I'm not giving up yet. I remember something. A farmhouse. On the other side of town. That night... The memories are confused, but... Somehow, I remember the farmhouse. You'll find a key to a safety deposit box somewhere in there. Go to the bank. And bring me the box that matches the key. Then you'll understand what happened to her. W wait Farm? Bank? What's this have to do with my friend? They left her, didn't they? She needed help, and they let her go. This is how we make it right. I don't understand. In the bank, you'll find the answers. Now go! Be losing my mind. It smells like food cooking in here. It's been a while since Grey Mother had anyone to make meals for. Please, take some soup before you go. Uh, thank you. That's really very kind. Right, okay, well, um, yeah, look, that's, we're gonna stall this one, because, um, we've done a bit of wandering around, and we'll just go outside, and <clears throat> we'll look at Milton, while I recap here. So, yeah, so we got some more tasks to do, we got to sort out Grey Mother's wood, and we gotta get her some more food, and probably now that we've got a couple of deer, we can probably put that particular task to bed. 
We have been around uh, the town of Milton, all around and about, and we've picked up scavenged and looted as much as we can. Um, my advice is, um, you know, we've repaired our clothes, so, so we're looking pretty good. Um, my advice is whenever you find a water source, fill up your water container. I'm pretty sure I have used every water source I can find so far, which uh, begs the question about figuring out how to melt snow. I mean, I've got a fire and I'm surrounded by snow, so there must be a way to melt snow in one of my tin cans. Right? I mean, there must be, right? Anyway, something to work out. Um, yeah, and I've been through and looted as much as I can, and I've been out to Paradise Meadows Farm, which is where my next destination's gonna be, and I've been up to the church, and been down here, and been down there. So, um, so yeah, that's it. I mean, Methuselah's vanished. We've got escaped prisoners on the loose. We've got rock slides. We've got wolves. Um, we've got the mysterious Grey Mother, who's obviously, um, talking about her lily, or something. Um... I guess we'll find out what the story about that is. Um, we just need to figure out what to do about getting to this uh, bank and uh, and Paradise Meadows. And um, that's it. So, yeah, I hope you're enjoying it. Um, we're getting into it. This is obviously the learning area, and we're learning a few things as we go, and that is the aim. And, um, you know, we can always come back, and we can always rest, and we can always um, sort ourselves out. It seems to be um, possible to get food from the wolves, so far but that's eventually going to run out as is the water situation so we're going to have to keep cracking but i think from here on we've scavenged a lot of milton so we just need to jump in and follow the story for a little bit and um and see where it leads us drop me a like please subscribe uh drop me any comments or thoughts or anything you feel about um the playthrough and i'll see you all again soon ta -ta for now PlayStation.